Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Edge Master Gaming, where today I'm going to be going over the next map that I wanted to play on the classic game mode, and that is Mill. Just like before, I'll be showing you the steps that I took in making it to the last wave, which will hopefully help you guys out as well. But before we get started, if you happen to like the gaming content on this channel, please hit that like and subscribe button below. Also, don't forget to check out the timestamps and site links in the description box that help support Edge Master Gaming. Alright guys, let's get started. So we're going to begin today starting on wave 9 of this map. I'm going with my same loadout as last time, both the RPG and M320. I decided to run in a counterclockwise pattern around the map, so let's go over my route. The good thing about this map is that there are many items that spawn in various places along the route that I'm going to show you. The first spot that I wanted to go over is this gas station. You can run through the store at the gas station as the infected more than likely won't come through the rear door, which will give you an opportunity to pick up items without being harassed. Next place is the guard shack. This place carries about 4 items which is really good for such a small space. You can be in and out pretty quickly. Up here on the left there are a set of logs that actually spawn items in between them as well. While moving around this building, you'll see this cart sitting here, which can also be a lifesaver. This building is pretty wide open. If you enter through here, I would run through very quickly and pick up items in the front here and towards the back sitting on these tables. Just be mindful to continue to look behind you so you don't get tagged. When coming up on this set of logs, there's a spot for a spawn right behind it. If you run inward here and then up, it slows the infected just slightly. And the last place to grab items is the back of this pickup truck. Running this route will take about a minute and a half to about a minute and 45 seconds. So if you can pull it off three times, you're almost home. So now that I've shown you all of these places to get items along the route, let's go skip ahead to wave 10 and see how I did. This will be a full wave uninterrupted.
So guys, that's going to do it for this video. If you're interested in more of my Those Who Remain videos, please click on the playlist that I made here. Also, I know that I got a bit overzealous in the last video asking for 500 likes, so let's do something a little bit more reasonable. Let's get this video up to 75 likes and I'll choose something like between prison and bypass. And as always guys, remember to have fun, take care, and God bless.